Happy Sunday, Tampa Bay. We're with you for another week to talk about the local real estate market like we are every Sunday at 10 a.m. here on the Duncan Duo Show. Uh, when we aren't on air, make sure to check out our social channels. We are at The Duncan Duo on Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube, and Facebook.com slash The Duncan Duo Show. Uh, if you're look curious about your home's value, make sure to check out our social channels. We are giving away a monthly Tampa Bay Lightning signed hockey stick for all the home value inquiries that we get through our social channels as well as Tampa Bay HouseValue.com for your most up-to-date home value estimate. Have Mike Yates with Atlantic Bay Mortgage as well as Bailey Nimmo from my real estate office who is a uh, transaction coordinator going to talk to us a little bit about our real estate team today and some of the unique things that we do at our company different than a typical real estate company where the real estate agent is the jack of all trades. We have specialists that work with our customers to make sure for a smooth uh, home buying process. I want to start out of the gate today though talking about the local real estate statistics. Uh, we talk about them every month in both our Tampa and Sarasota markets and uh, this, this week I'm going to talk about the Tampa stats for December of 2016. The real estate stats usually come out a couple, two to three weeks into the following month. So the December stats just came out and uh, we, we had a really strong December in Tampa, 2,939 home sales. And how does that compare to the last few years? Uh, 2,704 sales in December last year, 2,610 the year before that, and 2,209 in 2013. So significantly more home sales in December year over year. Uh, December was um, a couple of hundred sales better than November. Um, generally, there's a bigger uh, surge from November to December than there was this year, but our November was uh, un uncharacteristically strong. The average sale price in Tampa jumped to $253,199. Uh, that's flat from last month, which was also 253. But last December was 227, and the December before that was 212. So we continue to see a nice uh, 10 plus percent bump in our average sale price year over year. Uh, different uh, list to sell price ratio is 98 percent. Homes are taking a couple of months to sell, and we have only 2.6 months of inventory. That is the lowest amount of inventory that we have seen in a decade, uh, and and that compares to. 3.1 months last last December, four months the December before that, and six months of inventory the December before that. What's that mean for you? That means there's not as many home buying options, more bidding wars, more competition for hot listings. Uh, if you're a seller, it puts you in a great position to, to you know best position your home for the highest price. If you're a buyer, uh, prepare for a bidding war. And if you're a seller, you want to make sure to hire the right agent, uh, aka us, um, in a market like this because you need an agent that's going to be patient to uh, follow a proper process to allow enough offers to come in to get you the most amount possible. Um, again, continue to see surges in the single family home market. Condo sales are improving. Uh, if you climb the price charts, the inventory rises. Uh, under $100,000, just like a month of inventory. Uh, as you get up above a million dollars, uh, there's 13 months of inventory. Uh, so, so certainly, the higher the price point, uh, the more inventory there is. We did see uh, 23 home sales above a million dollars in December, so a nice luxury month uh, for Tampa Bay. Uh, but ultimately, there are uh, 292 of those homes on the market, so a lot of them that are not selling. The higher end stuff that does sell is selling on average for five plus percent off of asking and taking six months to sell. So if you're a luxury home seller, uh, the stories that you hear from your friends, family, and neighbors about their homes flying off the shelf and getting bidding wars. Uh, it's definitely not as likely for you uh, in your neighborhood and in that price range for uh, the million dollar stuff. Uh, 